a seat at the table over mint coffee and trifles. Let us speak of our pains, of our differences. Let us talk of all our fallacies and mistakes, our public masks and private disgrace. A generation of complainers we are often referred to, spoiled, vapid, shallow, surface, and uncouth. But who raised us? Who bequeathed broken things to young hands wrapped up in brown paper packages tied up with strings? And now, these empty and broken pieces are our favorite things. Let us really, really talk of a future cast in dismal solemnity, of uncertainty marking the faces of every woman and man I see, of torment and fear and just plain, I'm scared. Since a little before 2012, the killing of our black selves multiplied and blossomed like some damned flower, some hellfire root. Black girls and boys targeted again the stark reality. Our lives don't mean moot. Now, a country divided, drawn and quartered, tossed to the four winds, the playing ground of demons. No time to wear masks and coverings. We's real free, real, real free. People strip themselves and stand in the streets, in the churches, synagogues, temples, mosques, in the judicial buildings, construction sites, restaurants, uh, bed and breakfasts, malls, anywhere, nakedly bold. Bigotry and prejudice clinging to their new bodies, a new ancient mold. Across this wasteland, within the cesspool, Innocent babies butchered before seeing the light of day, all in the name of, it's my choice. Well, have it your way. A people's worst nightmare seated in the very White House. A 70-year-old boy child, unwell, unhealed, broken in all his mannerisms, waging a war on terror. When every day he lives, breathes, decides, and signs new terrorisms. Through the prism of public opinion and just plain news, distorted intel, the truth no longer celebrated, everything politically twisted and whack. Can't trust anything anyone says. Even lies are now alternative facts. What has happened to us? A people in the belly of insanity and still no one willing to really sit down a seat at the table, and still we hurtle at breakneck speed toward uncertainty. Yeah. Peace.